Well, right now we're trying to figure out ways to um, better engage the west side. We feel like there's that's kind of a piece of the pie that is being, um, I wouldn't say neglected, but we're not able to draw some of those people in because of the issues we have here downtown in terms of parking, um, you know, and, and just um, location. And, um, you know, we had talked previously about maybe putting in a West End branch, but then with the advent of the, um, the new county library branch, um, we, we see that those numbers are kind of going in that direction. And so we're trying to figure out a way to be um, um, creative and collaborative. And so we've decided to um, look into maybe doing a, a more projects with the county library system in hopes that maybe we can really do a better job of serving the entire city of Dubuque. Um, and that's kind of our hope at this point, is to kind of draw in those people and, um, and get some involvement maybe with the county in doing so. Okay. Can you talk to me about some of the other options that have been discussed? There was some discussion about um, some, um, I guess, um, mobile um, stands. Or can you talk a little? Sure. Um, mo uh, the mobile systems that we looked at um, tonight are um, kind of s sort of, of, of the same um, idea as the red box kind of thing. And, but you would also be able to pay your fines and fees, you would be able to check out, you would be able to reserve, you could pick up reserve items from those. However, the cost that comes with those, you know, is something that has to be really carefully investigated. And so we do, you know, if we do decide to go that direction, um, that would be something we'd have to look at. And probably um, in terms of use, we would discuss with other um, libraries that maybe have something like this in place. Um, to kind of make a um, determination as to how, what kind of, what our success rate is, what we're going to be looking for in terms of using that kind of service. But with that expense, you know, we want to make sure we're getting as much bang for our buck. So there was some discussion about doing some sort of a community survey. Can you talk about how that kind of ties? Yeah, sure. Um, the last time we did a community survey, an official um, community survey was four years ago. And, um, you know, over time, needs change, ideas change, thoughts change, perceptive perceptions change. And so it's always good um, to kind of stay on top of the the um, trends and, and what people, what direction people are going with um, what they want from the library. And we want to provide whatever services that we can to the people and that we're capable of doing. So the community survey is something that we're considering doing in terms of making sure that we're serving, you know, maybe the West End does not feel neglected. Maybe they feel like they need more ebooks. Maybe they would feel better served by a collaboration with the county. Maybe they would feel better served by something else, as well as, you know, continuing to make sure we are serving, you know, the entire city of Dubuque. We want the entire city represented. And so getting a, a survey can sometimes help us to better pinpoint where we need to improve and to know what we're doing well.